Mahadaji Shind Marathi Mahadaji Sindh Mahadaji Simde birth the 3rd of December 1730 and died the 12th of February 1794 also spelled as Mahaji Sindhya was a Maratha statesman and ruler of Gwalior in northern India He was the fifth and the youngest son of Ranoji Rao Sindhya the founder of the Sindhya dynasty Mahadaji was instrumental in resurrecting Maratha power in North India after the Third Battle of Panipat in 1761, and rose to become a trusted lieutenant of the Peshwa, leader of the Maratha Empire. Along with Madhavrao I and Nana Fadnavis, he was one of the three pillars of Maratha resurrection. During his reign, Gwalior became the leading state in the Maratha Empire and one of the foremost military powers in India. After accompanying Shah Alam II in 1771 to Delhi, he restored the Mughals in Delhi. Under the suzerainty of Marathas, Mahaji Shin's principal advisors were all Shenvis. He annihilated the power of Jats of Mathura and during 1772 73 he destroyed the power of Pashtun Rohilas in Rohilkhand and captured Najibabad. His role during the First Anglo-Maratha War was greatest from the Maratha side since he humbled the British in central India, single-handed, which resulted in the Treaty of Salbai in 1782, where he mediated between the Peshwa and the British. <laughs> Treaty of Salbai After the British defeat, Hastings through Muir proposed a new treaty, known as the Treaty of Salbai, between the Peshwa and the British that would recognize Sawai Madhavrao as the Peshwa and grant Raghunath Rao a pension. The treaty also returned to Shind all his territories west of the Yamuna and so was made to withdraw to Ujjain. A resident, Mr. David Anderson of St. Germain's who had negotiated the treaty was at the same time appointed to Mahaji's court. After the Treaty of Salbai in 1782, he invaded and overpowered the Rajput states, particularly Jodhpur and Jaipur through the Battle of Patan, the Battle of Merda. Even Sikh Sardars of the Sis Sutlej region paid tributes to him. <laughs> Later years Mahaji became Vakil Ulmatlak, region of Mughal affairs, and the Mughals also gave him the title of Amir ul Umara, head of the Emirs, in 1784. Another achievement of Mahaji was his victory over the Nizam of Hyderabad's army in a battle. The Nizam state ceased to be a factor in the North Indian politics after this battle, and it generally confined itself in the Deccan afterwards. After the peace made with Tipu Sultan of Mysore in 1792, Mahaji exerted his influence to prevent the completion of a treaty between the British, the Nizam of Hyderabad, and the Peshwa, directed against Tipu. <laughs> <laughs> Death and legacy After the Battle of Lakari, Mahaji was now at the zenith of his power, when he died, at his camp at Wanavdi near Pune on 12 February 1794. He left no heir, and was succeeded by Daulat Rao Sindhya. Kini, the English biographer of Mahadaji Shind, has described Mahadaji as the greatest man in South Asia in the 18th century. Mahadaji Shind's role was instrumental in establishing Maratha supremacy over North India. Shind Chhatri, located in Wanauri, in Pune is a memorial dedicated to Mahaji Shind. It is a hall that marks the spot of Mahaji Shind's cremation on 12 February 1794. The three-storied memorial in Rajput architectural style, is one of the most significant landmarks in the city. See also Mahaji Sindhya Sports Complex